Hello friends, I am Miss Carmen from the Pflugerville Public Library. Welcome to Kids Club. Kids Club is a program for children 5 to 8. Today we will be working on tissue paper flowers. This is the one I have already made. I hope you have fun. Very well, we're gonna get started. First we're going to review the materials that we need and also some tools. The only materials you pretty much need are some tissue paper and pipe cleaners for the stems. You will need also a little bit of tape and some tools. I just grab my tape. It's right here. Very well. You need a ruler something round, your stapler, putting it away, and some scissors and a pen or pencil. You will need the ruler to measure the size of your circle that you're going to use. I would say don't go bigger than five inches because you're going to need more sheets of paper if you do that. But So we're going to start with a five inch circle. I use a Pyrex uh, lid for it in eight sheets of tissue paper, squares of tissue paper. I'm going to show you how to cut your sheets of paper. This is a whole sheet of paper and you fold it to the size of the circle that you are going to create. In this case, it's, it just works out to fold it in half and then in half again. And you have to cut the strips. Then, you measure your circle and you fold to make sure that it fits. And you cut again. And you do it two more times and you get a lot of little squares. But you only need eight. So, put them all together as if they were one, grab your stapler and staple, use one staple in the, in the very center, of, like that. Then you grab your circle and you trace it. If it's not all the way, it's fine. I mean, you don't want it too sh too small, but see, mine is not all that perfect. And then you're going to cut it. Cut on the line. You don't want to leave any, any um, pointy corners, so you can round it. I pull it and round it very well. See, and you have all the circles to stay put together. Now you're going to separate one at a time and squeeze it in the middle. And then I do the second one. This is the easiest tissue paper flower that I have ever made. Here you go. So you fold one by one all the layers. We're almost done. One by one all the layers. See how it's looking like a flower? That's all I did. There you have it, a pink tissue paper flower here. I hope you have fun making lots of these and that you find different uses for them. There you go, all done. Very well, 
we are finished with our flower today. I added a stem to mine and you can do it too with a pipe cleaner and some tape. You squeeze the part where the staple is and you tape the stem to the back of the flower. Use these flowers to decorate a special corner in your room to make a bunch of flowers for your mom or somebody that you care for and have fun very well. Thank you for watching my video today and I hope to see you guys again next week. Bye! Happy summer!